folks that took it. Uh, I take it they aren't the only ignorant bullying clod hoppers in these parts. But I can live in glorious hope. Ah, it wasn't a trouble now, was it? No, it was a pleasure. Well, let me give you something for your pleasure. Ah, what we got here. Ah, how about this? Provide a man a tincture, he'll be well for a day. Teach him to make one, he might be well a while longer. Well, I'll make sure to try and make this. Thank you. <sighs> Thank you. It won't work for anything chronic, but you may not need it to. Well, if you see me on my travels and you're in need of something, make sure you come and say hello. Travel safe now. Está cerrado por el incidente, ¿no? Imagino. Wey, wey. Vale. Hey, mister. Will you give me some money? Claro, sí. Sure. Sure. Well, thank you. Say, say, where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from right here. Yeah, it was you I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, yeah ever since them... Them Greys moved here. A bunch of no-good white trash. And they, they somehow got rich. About 50 years ago, they moved here, caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, they reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Hey, y'all. Morning, to you. Morning, partner. Okay. As a sign of respect to our creator, we pay respect to the dead. Tell us straight, Father. Sir, we're in a moment of grief. Oh, Father, what do we say about a man who lost his way so awfully? He carried that awful war with him, rustling horses with a misguided gang of killers. A brave man, undone by pride, doomed to a life of sin and vice. Let us pray for this man, O oh Father, provide him mercy. Amen. Hello, mister. Hello. How's it going with you? Sorry. Can't put my finger on it. God be with you. Enough! Let's see what the law says! Que era broma! Que era broma! Que era broma! Perdón. No sabía que se lo iban a tomar tan mal. Yo soy las autoridades, gilipollas! Yo sabía que... Vale. En mi... En mi cabeza había algo que era como... Hazlo. A ver qué pasa. Conejo. Uy.
un momento. Ay. Perdón. ¿Se tropició? Tú, tú, levanta. Mucho un tiro. Escopeta. Estaban cazando sin más. Bueno. Hey, excuse me. Exacto. Exactamente, ¿ves? Entonces, ¿qué hemos aprendido? Que robar a, uh, cadáveres, pues, pues tampoco es tan malo. ¿Qué quiere decir eso? Pues... Matas a alguien y le robas ya muerto. Que robar un cadáver es mejor que robar a alguien que sigue vivo. I order a Judge Meredith Holden in the courts of the state of Lemoyne. We do hereby grant repossession of this property and all items here into the bank of roads. M. Holden, Judge Holden, Henrietta Blackley Clerk. November 18th, 1895. Exactamente lo mismo. El reloj That's the old watch Now the ledger and the pistol Okay Where is all this old crap? There ain't nothing here any value. I wouldn't give you a nickel for it. Come by for a sup of whiskey anytime. 
Bill. Yes. I was sorry. No! Oh, that no sabía que había de paz. April 2nd, 1870. Dear Mr. Thompson, I'm afraid there's no more work for you down here at the plantation. I'm grateful for the help you've given us and the help your pappy and your pappy's pappy gave us before you. These are trying times for all of us. You are in our thoughts and prayers. Yours truly, Colonel J. Nixon, the Ascension Plantation. Vale. Thanks indeed for your talk to our Sunday school class. <laughs> Thought you might like this drawing young Josh did of you. He wants to grow up to be just like you. Sam. Le da muchísimo al alcohol, se conoce. Oh, God damn it. Told you to stay away from the boy. He don't want this. Heck, none of us want nothing to do with you. Rance. this place first yeah easy I'm just looking around for some things hmm. that old revolver yours hmm. finders keepers ah son of a bitch oh god damn it, damn it. Oh, come on man where are you going come on gonna get you ah. Um, ¿Por qué creo que su antiguo trabajo era el del esclavismo? Bueno, se acabó lo que se daba. Estaba cerca de Rhodes cuando me atraparon. No olvidaré hasta el día... Eh, eh. No olvidaré hasta el día en el que muera los ladridos de ese perro junto a mis pies, aunque dudo que falte mucho para, que, para ese día. 
Ayer me dieron 50 latigazos Si me darán 50 más No creo que pueda soportarlo más El hombre dijo que estaba haciendo su trabajo Creo que aún... Creo Aunque mi pasión no, imp no importe Que ese tipo de empleo es cuanto menos curioso Está oscureciendo Así que se acabó por ahora Espero vivir para ver el final de esta guerra Y la victoria de la justicia Junio del 64 Well, that's that. I was somewhere ah. near Rhodes when they caught me. Till the day I die, I ain't gonna forget the sound of that dog barking in my heels. But I don't suppose that day. God. Ya lo he leído, así que. No, es durante la guerra, así que yo creo que. Aquí pillaba. ¿Sabes? Y interrogaba, dejamos like. This your ledger? A list of slaves? No, pues sí. Uh, rewards. January 15th, Betsy, $17. January 18th, Louise, $12. May 18th, Wilfred, $18. May 24th, Minnie and Child, $20. Esclavista. Come on now, boy. Okay there. De hecho, aquí es donde nos quedamos. Sí. Ah, eso es lo que sale ardiendo. Yo está en la casa. Luego en este juego la polla. You asked me to get you something. There's no bringing back what I want. I want my job, my pride, the respect accorded to a gentleman. What about this old crap? Huh? My things. Don't you understand? Those bastards have changed everything. I was a good worker. I took pride in my work. They, they, they took it away. Pissed on my legacy. Oh, man. Some jobs ain't for saving. And some legacies? Oh, they are for Ooh, pissing What off. are you doing? That's that's my history. Damn you! Damn you! I still exist. Oh.
move next time. I'm sorry. No puedo. There we go. Ah, pues sí. ¿Qué pasaría si tiro un poquito más? Compañero Si hago ¿Eh? ¿Qué, ¿Qué pasaría? Exacto Desatar. Hombre, claro que me dan honor Por matar a un esclavista Y, y por matar a los de Cuscus El Cucus También Exacto, los del cuscús. Okay. Yo también me he asustado. Yo también. Me pillo desprevenido, no te voy a engañar.
Hey there, boy. Can I help you there? Sure. Those are supposed to be my business partners here. They arranged a meeting, I believe, about some horses. A fellow with a scar and a Mexican? Yes, sir. Out by the stables. Thank you. Have a wonderful day now. Esto es un atajo, ¿vale? You're good man. Like you. You don't know me. You turn up in this town and you're helping everybody. And have you met my partner, Arthur Morgan? No. I met your son, the sheriff. Okay. Mr. Gray here was saying how he had problems with a family. A family of degenerates. Oh well, nobody likes degenerates. The hag and her inbred sons. They ruined this county. They killed my uncle, you know. That ain't right. Problem is, we can't be seen to get too close. And? We've got gold, Yankee. We've got gold. I ain't no Yankee, friend. I ain't nothing. My daddy came over on the boat from Scotland. I'm Scottish. And the Braithwaites? Goddamn peasants. I don't know. Mongrels. Slave fuckers. All you gotta do is look at them. How much gold? Enough. These are prized horses I'm talking about. Them, they'll get you... 5,000. 5,000? For horses? Easy. And where do we sell them, these $5,000 horses? Over in Clemens Cove. Fell over there, we'll run them out of state and give you 50 cents on the dollar. Mister, you got yourself a deal. Just keep us away from this. Publicly, I mean. My sense is we keep all horse wrestling away from the public. Go to the stables on the south side of the manor. That's where they keep the thoroughbreds. Yeah! Well, Javier, tengo el caballo más chiquito de la banda, me hace como mucha gracia. Muchísima, eh. Crazy old fool. You should see the Braithwaite woman. Jose and Sean were planning on going over to the Braithwaites. You haven't seen them? No, not yet. If they're there already, they better keep their heads down. We don't need this to be any more complicated than it already is. Five thousand dollars for horses. We've been robbing the wrong folk all these years. Yeah. He doesn't know what he's talking about. But if we get even a third of that, it'll be worth it. So how are we gonna play this? The place is well guarded. So there ain't no point in blasting in there. We'll make them think we're there looking to purchase. Three armed men? You'd be armed if you were about to spend 5,000 on horses. We should go in the back way, though. Avoid too many questions. <laughs> Careful. There's a guard. I'll speak to him, okay? <sighs> All right, then. Can I help you, gentlemen? Yeah, we're here to see about some horses. Horses? Yeah, we had a, an appointment with Mr. Braithwaite, I believe. Yeah, I never heard about any of this. Our partner wanted to make a significant investment in some stables down here. But perhaps we should look elsewhere. Well, I... Okay, then. But head on up to the stables. Someone will come see you. Yeah. 